first blood fight. Sidon kills two Sidon kills This dock is off limits pending an on this dock is off limits pending an on I don't know what it is, but you look different. It's hard to explain, but it's uh it's good to see. shows. It's kind of inspiring, to be honest. Anyway, just wanted to mention it. I think the others have noticed it too. Alright, but I'm out of credits, so it's Republic Senate rules. Yes, have you? Very well. The knowledge has already been imparted to you. Upon our journey. Very well. What is it that drives you? Very well. Of which did you wish instruction? Something up? Admiral Onasi, this is Lieutenant Gren, TSF. We've been expecting you. Gren, it's nice to know that TSF hasn't gone to shambles in my absence. And how about you, an admiral? You might change your tune after you see what the situation is like down here, Karth. I've got some bad news for you. 
Well, it can't be that bad, Grant. I think Telos has already been through the worst. The one you came all the way out here to pick up? Well, she managed to escape the station. We're not exactly sure how it happened. Well, that's unfortunate, but luckily it still fits our plans. Am I hearing this right? I'll tell you more when I arrive, but the Republic has decided not to detain the Exile and adopt a wait-and-see approach. The Exile? Then... Like I said, we'll talk more when I arrive. Looks like we will. I'm uploading the approach vector to you now. See you soon, Admiral. Good to have you back, General. Easy now. You survived one spectacular crash. Lucky I was here to pull you and your friends out of that shuttle, or you'd be more than a little crispy. But it's only fair. I owe you more than one, General. You must be in shock from the crash. Have to expect some long-term memory loss from that. Too bad she's not a droid, huh? We can't all be that lucky. I'll humor you, General. I was one of the Iridonian Mechanic Corps that was at Malachor. Vader. I can see how you'd forget me, being that I was the only one. Don't think too hard. I'd rather not talk about the war, if we could. We all went through some tough times after Malachor, and maybe we all did a little forgetting. Guess that's one thing we've got better than droids. They can't forget anything. But then you give them a memory wipe and they forget for good. They'll be fine. The pilot's more or less unharmed, and the old lady, well, she's tougher than she looks. You know, I never thought I'd see you again, General. Galaxy's a big place, and this is the last place I thought I'd bump into you. So I have to ask, just what are you doing here? Well, if your ship's in as bad shape as this one, I don't think you're gonna have much luck. <clears throat> well, this is familiar. Feels like my last time on Telos. Crashed the shuttle that time, too? No, Pazak. That was not the most pleasant landing I've endured. Next time, we should perhaps seek out a more reputable pilot. You're welcome, Kreia. You know, if I weren't such a crack pilot, we could have hit the shield wall or one of those rock faces. Yes, our current situation is a vast improvement. Beats me. No one's supposed to be here but a Zerka research team. I can't say they'd be happy to see us, but shooting us down? I can't imagine Zerka having us shot down by a bunch of scientists either. You know, I caught a glimpse of what looked like an AD tower when we flew over the compound. Maybe they're doing something they shouldn't be. I've seen pirate bases with the same sort of setup. I can help you find it. I have access to the S.H.I.E.L.D. network. I came hoping to repair whatever damage your shuttle took, but not even I can fix that wreck. We'll have to get back to the compound. It's the old Athorian research station, turned into a salvage team staging area. It won't be an easy hike. First, there's a mercenary pursuit team looking for me. If Zerka secure the compound, there could be a lot of them out there. Second, there's all the chemics. The vicious, wide-jaw predators the Athorians imported from Duxon. They were meant to keep the herbivore population in check. Right. The Canucks ate them all. Now they'll eat anything they can catch, including us. Without the Athorians to maintain the accelerated ecosystem's balance, everything here is falling apart. Zerka's killing the Restoration Project piecemeal. That's the plan.
Hey, General, are you all right? You look like you've been standing too close to one of my shield generators. Was this something you wanted me for? If the Republic would just rein Zerka in, there'd be no problem. But as long as Zerka is allowed to undermine the Athorian's efforts, Telos will remain dead. I can't take seeing my work being used by those bloodsuckers. But there's nothing I can do about it, so let's talk about something else. Something else I can help you with? I got tired of it. Kept dropping my hydro spanner. Figured I'd get a new one. I was only kidding. Actually, it was a souvenir from Malakor. I was lucky it was all I lost. But at least it gave me something to do, right? Everyone always said I was probably half machine anyway. Something else I can help you with? That old thing? I built him when I was a kid. Been following me around for years now, despite what I've done to try and chase him off. Hey, just kidding. I'm happy to have you around. He helps me out with repairs. I outfitted him with a cutting laser and some other tools for delicate modifications. He's also good for singeing the pants of annoying techs. I've been thinking about doing some other work on him, but I barely have time. Too busy fixing up the ship. Something else I can help you with? Why did you decide to fight? The war went poorly before Revan and the Jedi lent aid to the Republic. Many of us believed the Jedi to be cowards who were afraid to face the Mandalorian threat. I remembered when word of the Mandalorian attacks arrived on Iridonia. My people had colonies across the Outer Rim. Many of them were among the first systems to fall. I did not join because I wanted to protect, though. I hated them. I wanted to destroy them. To give them the mercy they gave the people they conquered. 
I remember the thrill I felt when we fought them in battle. Victories were rare, but we celebrated every Mandalorian's death. Do you know how it felt? It's always on my mind now. That loss of control blinded me, turned me into a weapon. I just needed to get that off my chest. Was there something you wanted me for? Sure do, General. I've made a few just to remember. The best something else. Sure do, just some. Why did you decide to fight? I felt the same way. I, my people. Revenge, and to crush the Mandalorian. I did not join because I wanted to protect. I remember, do you know how it? It's all, I was a. Something up? All right, what did you want to know? Mercenaries, right where we need to go. That sentry droid probably spotted us already. Great. They were probably looking for me when they saw your shuttle go down. We could try handing the Zabrak over. You know, bargaining chip? Who do you think shot you down in the first place? Good point. Forget I said anything.
Another sentry droid. The mercenaries must be using them to locate us. There's probably another patrol nearby. Wait, bounty? Why is there a bounty on your head? Chiso maranesh in sando krampa molektek. Se namaranse, wana konbes, ching palam... I don't think so. You'll have to come through me if you want to take the general. Guma sonne, machi...
I always feel a sense of calm when I walk the surface of Telos. The Athorians are truly amazing in their work. Amazing at wasting the Republic's credits, maybe. But now that you mention it, I think I feel it too. Like a weight's been lifted off my shoulders. Quiet. There's a large mercenary patrol up ahead. If we move carefully along the perimeter, we may be able to get by without their spotting us. We could cross along the shore, or head along the cliffs to the south. I'll follow close.
Let's <laughs> go. 
There's the landing pad. There should be a computer terminal I can access from there. Looks like we're gonna have to fight our way there, though. Why do you say that? What do we have here? The Jedi. Saves us the trouble of looking for you. Corin Fault did say you were dangerous. Maybe he does know what he's talking about. Why would I do that? When I can just as easily take them from your corpse. Fault hired me to keep everyone out of the Restoration Zone. You in particular. A grenade with your name on it, Jedi. Attack!
Hopefully, I'll be able to access the shield network from this console. Good. It's functional, and my passcodes still work. Now let's find your ship. The TSF probably thinks the ship was put down in the wastes, but they don't know the planet as well as I do. Telos's atmosphere has been turned into acidic vapor. Landing a ship in the wastes would be like sealing it in a hangar full of hungry Minox. I'd say there's probably an illegal landing site somewhere, then. So that means there's probably an unsanctioned landing site somewhere on the planet. Still shielded, but not a restoration zone or other listed facility. That's why I need access to the shield network. Here, a small anomaly in the shield network's power grid. I'm not surprised the TSF didn't spot this. It's subtle, more like an error or random flux than anything suspicious. It looks like power is being drawn to generate a shield over a small area in the polar region, but nothing should be down there. Orbital camera show. Nothing. Just an empty mesa. That's a little tougher. According to the computer, a shuttle is currently docked inside the research facility. At least there was at last report, though that was months ago. I don't, but that's not going to stop me. I'm getting back to Citadel if I have to build a new ship myself. That's decided then. We should get going. There's one other small problem. Recently, Zerka teams that were sent into the military facility have not been coming out. But it's not as though we have any choice. General, need something? Sorry, guess I can't get my head out of the past. I moved around for a couple years. Working as a starship mechanic got me from place to place. I wasn't ready to settle down after the war. Then you understand my restlessness. Though the war had ended, I couldn't find peace in anything. As long as I kept moving, I didn't have to think about what happened. Know what I mean? I'm sure you do. I decided I'd do something constructive. I wanted to make up for the things I'd done in the war. I wanted to design planetary shields, but there weren't many systems with the credits to spare. There was more that needed to be rebuilt than protected. I found out that Telos was going to be the flagship project for the Republic, and it sounded like something good. I saw Telos before the Sith raised it, and deserved a better fate. But Zerka ruined everything. I thought I could force Zerka out on my own, but I guess I can't fix everything myself. All I wanted to do was send a message, but I couldn't even do that right. That's the past, though. It's good to be working with you again, General. Something else I can help you with? Sure do, General. Just remember. Something else? Sure do. Just some... Yes, General?
Thank you. 